Eric, how are you? Yeah. Hey, do we have a mic on him? We have him? a mic on him. Do I need to do something here? Oh, oh there I you hear go. you. There we go. I hear you. Thanks What's for up, joining man? us. Hey, how's it going? I'm um, doing well. Thanks. How's the show having... doing for you so far? It's going great. We are slammed all day yesterday and uh, getting a lot of good feedback and people checking out the stuff. So so that's good. good. I think today will be even busier and, and oh, possibly yeah. Saturday was going to be busy because a lot of people who can't come here because they're at work, they're going to be here right, Saturday. Right. Yeah. No, it, it's great to be here for sure. Excellent. So what do you have to show us? Yeah, so um, I might have overpacked. I brought a few things, but... We'll make it quick. Cool. So I know this is a favorite of, of Jared's. Jared's seen before, Alta Pro 263 AGH. And this is a, you know, a tripod kit that, that I know you're familiar with, but I thought some other folks might want to take a look oh, at it. Oh, yeah, I love the AT with the... Um, I, love the I love this grip. Talk yeah, about this with grip. with the grip head. So this is a combination pistol grip and uh, ball head. Check it out. I've got the wireless camcorder here. You're going up top? And I'm going to... I'm going to get all up in here. Okay, okay so you've got... Um, that is a very interesting trigger-looking thing. Yeah, so you've got a, you know, set your tension. It's in place. Use your grip. You can move it. Hand this way. It's got a um, handle that can be changed to eight different positions. So whatever's convenient for you. It's got an uh, independent panning lock here. Uh, 70, Panoramic. 72 click point panorama. So really? Five degree clicks each time. So for easy stitching when you're done to do your panorama. Quick release plate with the uh, with the D ring. Just for oh Jared. good, it has the D okay. ring. It's yeah. got to have yep. the D ring yep. to make it easy because sometimes you don't have change <laughs> in your pocket. Right. So do you, know, uh, you know what I have to say about this when you're flying with it because you guys okay. give a bag with this. Correct. Um, you have to be very careful. That the that oh, the pistol yeah. grip isn't the only thing hanging out right. when you go to fly because that's something that that I noticed before I flew so I turned oh. it around backwards because right. it looks like a pistol. It looks like a gun. I mean, like it looks like an. I actual didn't want them thinking I had a gun carrying on a plane, so I, I made sure to turn it around the other way. We've actually had uh, some of our sales reps run into that problem as well. So yeah, um, you know this is on our Alta Pro tripod, which is our one of our most popular tripods. It's what we're probably best known for in the tripod market right now, and. Uh, what this allows you to do with this combination is very simply, you can. Uh, oh yeah, yeah this, this is. You're gonna get it. I know you got it. Right. By there. the way, Alvin says he's watching the broadcast from his class in college. Hey, Alvin, like a boss. Well, he should be watching it from class because we're probably learning <laughs> more here. <laughs> All right. So whoa, now, whoa, you oh, almost sorry about me. that. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, nice. But the but the pins weren't <laughs> out, so that's good. Right. I put them in just for you. I didn't want to impale anybody on the stage here. So now we're able to kind of bring the the, the center post up and right. articulate it out. So, for example, in one if we wanted to take a picture of Jared's Nikon here on the table, exactly. you could uh, we could put this right over whoa, here. Whoa, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> if you're going to do that, let's use the cannon. <laughs> exactly. We could put that right over here yep. and then point it right down at it. Yeah, exactly. It's awesome. great for macro. So I've used it to do macro video. Well, to do macro video. What I would do is I'd use the Instax. I'd take a pic instant picture, set the camera up, put the, the instant picture below it, let the camera run using this tripod and a macro lens, okay. and then speed it up later in the computer, yeah. and it makes a really good impression when you're doing video. Very cool. Very cool. Yeah, so um, you know, very simple to use. It's got this lever, lets you work through a bunch of different angles. Whatever angle you want to do can and pan this way. So very, very simple to use, I think, is the sort of the key to our system. I know some other people have a feature like this. We sort of really focus on functionality and being able to use it very simply and very easily, very quickly. What material is this? This aluminum? is an aluminum, yep. You do make a carbon fiber version? We do as well, yep. I've, I took that one away because that's really light, but this is still very sturdy and light. Yeah. It's not that heavy for an aluminum tripod. No, I think it's right around six pounds for the whole, for the whole, for the whole kit here. You know, I, I really, uh, there are two different camps when it comes to these legs uh, uh, with the with flip the, and the twist. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there's the twist and there's these flip ones. Right. Personally, I'm a flip one kind of guy because I just don't have the patience to sit there and untwist right. all of them. So I like that. I like the uh, the the same kind of lever up here. Yeah. You just flip it open. I didn't see though. How does it go back down? How do I get it back? Yeah, I want sure. it right back down in the middle there. So it's got a safety button here. So because okay. the last thing you want is to have it, you know, like this fall and out. then drop it and fall out. So the safety button here. With ten thousand dollars with a camera on it. So when you, uh, you just push in the safety button, slide it up, okay. slide Listen it back the through. click and you're good to go. Yeah. Well, you got to push it back in, so there you go. Okay, gotcha. And you lock in here. Gotcha. So it's, it's all one piece. 
Yes. And that's what makes it easy. You don't have to take things apart. Right. And how much does this particular model go for in both aluminum and carbon fiber? The, uh, the aluminum is about 260, and the, and the carbon fiber is, we don't sell Wait the Wait a minute, is it 260 with that grip? With the head, yeah, for the whole kit. Yeah. That's ridiculous. Alan's okay, go got them. Yeah. Wow. Alan has them. He's got a whole stock how load much, of them. Then how much with the carbon, tri uh, carbon fiber? The carbon, uh, the legs alone is around, uh, I think, 350, or getting up around 400. Uh, the, we don't actually do a kit with this, but you could always get it separate. We actually have an upgraded model of this also that has a uh, 38 millimeter, like Arca style quick release. Uh -huh. So if that's your thing, um, you can get the upgraded model that's a, it's a little bit more. And so I can buy just that grip and put it on the sticks I already Correct, have. Yeah. And how much would that cost me with the, with the Arca Swiss mount? With the Arca Swiss, it's about 200. Yeah. I really like the fact that it has the little clip, clicks for the uh, panoramic yeah. stuff because yeah. I've been looking for something like that. I, I, I need something that's painless and idiot proof so that I don't screw it up and, and mess up when I'm somewhere, you know? I like sure. that, that sounds great. Very cool. uh, okay, what yeah, else do you have? Yeah, we'd love to let you review it. I know you're doing some reviews. Uh, yeah. I know we get to talk too much yesterday, but if you want to stop back by, we can Definitely. give you a little closer look or we yeah. can get you one you know, for review. That would be great, that would be great. I, so I, will, I would love, yeah, what else especially the grip, I'm should really Should we stick interested. with tripods or should we go to a bag? Tripods? Tripods, okay. Uh, you, know, you know what I've been using? I, um, I picked up, I have a 302.8, and I've been using the carbon fiber monopod. Okay. It's replaced my old one because it's just really light. It won't beat people as much if I'm walking in the city because it, yeah. it, it used to, the steel one I had was protecting me when I walked in the in Philly. You could take them down with one swing with that thing. This may take two swings because right. it's carbon fiber, but at least it's lighter to swing. Won't take as much energy True. to hit. And, this and also, is, if you happen to break it on one. them, you know those carbon fiber uh, splinters. Those are nasty. Ooh. So you could really get you know get them good with it. <laughs> wow! Look at these so, feet. But I don't even know what you're going to say about it, but look at these feet. These things are awesome. What do you call that? So these are snow and sand shoes. So if you wow. want to get up on some snow or take it to the beach, use it in the wintertime, you can take this off. You've got a rubber foot down here. So a nice grip on a hard surface. Or if you want to dig into the ground, you've got spikes. So we give you options for basically any, any surface you could want to use it on. This is our Abeo Plus model. This is kind of the big... The big heavy guy, you right? You know, I don't For, have this one. You don't have it. We need to get you one. If you, you want. You've sent me enough. You tasted it yesterday. Oh, I did. This is yeah. the one I bit? Yeah. Oh, I you tried tasted the taste it, test. Huh? Well, because when you're doing a sniff test, that's one thing. Yeah. But sometimes you just have to get closer and take a chunk out of it you, to get all the sensory glands all, all kicking in Yeah, you in need to once. know how, how, what kind of quality. By the way, we, we did get a question in the chat room, which one of these is best for video as opposed to photo. So if you want to deal with okay. that while we're talking. Yeah, so, so we, um, we do also have some video heads. I didn't bring any today, but if you go on our website, uh, Vanguard www.vanguardworld.com. Vanguardworld.com. Yeah. And, um, you know, you got to choose your region, so go to U.S., and then you can look under tripods. You can see all of our, uh, all our tripods and all our heads. And the, the, for video right now, we have sort of limited offerings, but um, some more things are coming down the pipeline. I think people who really are excited about video will be interested in seeing that will come out around CES. Do you know what I'd be interested in? What's that? Honestly, it's a little bit of both in one tripod. Yeah, yeah. Because sometimes I find with the video tripods, I want to fix the axis, but you only have forward and back. You don't have this type of angle and you have to move right. the feet. It would, be, it would be really cool if there was some kind of locking mechanism that allowed us to do both. And By the way, Gigi Good is idea. telling me I have to pay more attention to the chat room um, because they are interested customers. Okay. okay. <laughs> First of all, we didn't go over this yet, but what's the model number of the one we're looking at and what is the price? Right now we're looking at a Bayo Plus 323 carbon fiber with the head, so it's 323CB, uh, carbon meaning, or C for carbon fiber, B for a ball head. Um, price for the whole kit is right around 600 retail. Okay. This is a big boy. This is a big boy. So more of a professional model. I know everyone's looking for smaller and lighter. Well, the 263AT is yeah. perfect for that. I mean, right. you said 260 with the ball, with the, uh, the, the pistol grip. Yep. That's one that I would carry all day long, especially at that price range, under 300. Yeah. How much does this weigh, and how much will it carry? Oh, and getting, which of these will go? Which of the these specs. can we carry on the plane? We've got a lot of questions. Oh, on the plane, <laughs> I carry them all on the plane, no matter what. What about right. this one? I still carry it. You know, technically, here's this has been my experience. Now, this one is pretty big. Okay, 
Um, and uh, but it's been my experience that they that if you kind of go like this, and that's just, no good. Yeah. I, I actually they let me write on. Really? They let me write on if I just kind of do this. But you got to keep the angle just right. Like if yeah. you're the check-in person, I angle it like this, and I just kind of walk on by. Keep but, the keep the rubber over the spikes. So they don't. Think yeah, got a yeah. Weapon. yeah. But they will if it's too long. Um, they can tell you that you'll have to check it. Yeah. I just so. I just love the build quality of these. So you've got the leg angles like the other. Um, again, the, as far as all the specifications, if you go on our website, vanguardworld.com, you know you can you can pour over every spec you could possibly want there. Okay. Uh, I think that might be an easier way for people to, who want to compare. Um, but but yeah, this this unit weighs about uh, I think six and a half seven pounds. Um, it'll support up to twenty seven pounds. It's not bad. Um, the head itself is actually rated for quite a bit more than that, but the the legs are rated for twenty seven. This is our BBH ball head that it comes with, which is our professional series ball head. Is that the one that auto levels? Auto levels, You know, I right. haven't figured that one out yet. Wait, yeah, how does, wait, auto levels? Yeah, so let's... Uh, the ball head auto levels. Well, how is that even I mean, possible? It, it requires a little work on your part, but... Did so the you, bird just fly by again? Yeah, I, I saw it earlier. So, you know, now it's totally loose, right? Get it for the camera guy here. So there's a leveling Nuclear switch here. Nuclear isomer is asking Flip if over I your could level type switch. in the URL for you guys. And it helps you guide the level right away. Now I'm it's not stuck actually level. logged in. Now you lock I'm it just in. watching the chat room go. But if somebody there, so now you're when set I, for when I throw those things out, if you guys perfect can, if panorama one of you can, level to the base. If one of you can type it in, that'd be great. Sorry, I don't know if you caught that. Maybe no, I need to show I was it again. Say that one more time. So one I was showing time. the cameraman here. So you un unlock it. There's a switch here. So now you're totally loose. You're in portrait mode. You're shooting. You want to go to level as quick as you can. Flip this button. Oh, oh wow. Finds it. How, does oh. That, you lock it down. How do they do that? It's called magic. Yeah. Wow. Here, let me see it from this side. Sure. Um, uh, let me see the camera, Dave. Oh. Let me show, because they didn't get to see that button. I want, I want them to see that one more time real okay. close. So. Hang on just a sec, guys. Let, let me, me get this steady up. here. Okay, let's do that again. Okay. So now so it's you, totally you, loose. You, you've got your camera. You're mounted over there. You're taking a picture in portrait mode. Now you want to level Flip it. Flip the switch. Well, there. It kind of wow. locked into place. Locked into place. It just locks into place. You know, then you can check if you want to really examine the levels, then lock it in for extra security, and you're good to go. Ingenious. Wow. OK, Dave, I'll give you this back. OK. Um, that's amazing, uh, especially because you guys also have the pistol grip thing that's cool. So now you got a ball head thing that's cool I'll as well. So, sure. Do you have any other good toys? Yeah, I'll show a couple of bags. Uh, you off. got a bag. Let's see the bags. So this is uh, probably our biggest, our biggest bag this year. This is our Heralder series. It won the uh, Tipo Award for best bag for 2012. It's a messenger style bag. Has a built-in tripod sling, so you can carry a tripod right on your messenger bag. There is oh. a feature on this bag that is that Ari likes because Ari uses for video oh, okay. when when we were taking it out. It's the ability to get into it from the top, from the top right, without the having top to access. flick it open. So you are these things available in Australia? We have a distribution in Australia. Yes. Yes, they are available in Australia. Uh, Royal Kennedy, something like that. CK Kennedy, something. That's a distributor over there. I don't okay. work with them regularly, but I know we're over there for sure. Okay. So yeah, quick top access to all your gear. Sometimes people worry about water getting in here. You know, it's, it's generally, I think, weather resistant, but there is a built-in rain cover. So if you're out in a torrential rain and you're worried about it, just pop out the rain cover and slip it over. Inside, you've got a ton of space. This is the largest model. There's actually three models. There's a, uh, goes all the way down to a size more for like a compact setup and an iP iPad or something. This would be your larger setup. It's got space for a 15-inch laptop. It's got this fully removable box where you can put all your gear so you can use it as a regular messenger bag if you want to. And uh, just plenty of pockets, plenty of places for gear. Um, nice thick padded strap. Yeah, everything's nice. Nice just belt. And there's some extra, extra bags ac in there. Accessory pouches, yep. They work well. It's got a three-point attachment strap, so if you're biking or you want to just hold your bag extra close, you can do an extra strap to keep it close to you while you're running and gunning, doing events, things like that. So really just wanted like a fast-paced messenger style bag for events, for photojournalists, for you know, videographers, like yeah. I said. Uh, it so, works well. And uh, super you know, solid build quality. You can feel nice, it's, that's nice material. So. What is the material? It's, you got me it's on the It's a spot. nylon, yeah, guys. Yeah. It's, a, it's, it's a really tight woven nylon. It looks. Yeah. And there's some neoprene on the side yeah. for yeah, the pockets. Yeah, a little neoprene. Uh, it looks extremely high quality. Second handle it here for if you just want to grab it quick, you know, and 
move it from place to place. And also an attachment, if you're carrying a trolley or a roller bag, you can slide it over there. Right. So. Some people say they prefer a backpack. Do, do you make a backpack model of it? Not of this particular bag. We do have several backpack models. Again, if you go to vanguardworld.com, you can see all the bag models we have. I brought this one just because it's been a very, seems like one people are asking about a lot lately ever since it yeah. won the award. And we did a rebate on it earlier in the year. It's gotten some good response. So. Awesome. Uh, um, hey, Eric, we are, we are out, out of time. time. Fair but enough. Um, thank you so much for showing us all the goodies. Thanks Amazing for having me. Stuff. It's been great. Be yeah. sure Amazing to take stuff. this off my hands. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't want to take that bad boy. We will, okay. we will uh, come by and chat with you later, so maybe we can get some units and we'll do full-on reviews. and We can share them with all of you guys. So uh, uh, thanks again. It's the, been great. Yeah, that was awesome. Team yeah, will get I love you, those things. The thank team you. will get you disconnected. So you, Excellent. Yeah, you I don't want to mess anything up here. Yeah. All right. Thanks so much. Thanks a lot. We'll yep. see you later on. See you.